guys welcome back to the channel i just want to make a quick video here today <clears throat> this is off of my uh, new project um this is my own personal project a uh, it's a 2002 f-150 with a 4.6 uh four-wheel drive and uh i had i'll have pictures for putting the video it's really nice and uh it it, it runs it seemed it runs really good but every once in a while the oil pressure would the oil pressure gauge would just dip down then it go back up it dip down and it still ran fine but well we bought it with the transmission issue and i wanted to make sure we played it safe um even though the motor was running pretty good i wanted to make sure we played it safe because you know there's a chance yeah sure the oil the oil sending units and the uh the gauge sometimes they do mess up but there's also sometimes that, you know, it's for real. <clears throat> well, so uh, anyway, I decided to go ahead and take off the pan. And as you can see, I am so glad I did. This was in the, uh, this is actually in, one of these was in the oil pickup tube. That's actually a piece of timing rail. It's a piece of timing rail had uh, got sucked up to the old pump pickup tube. And I made videos on this before on the five fours. Hardly ever happens on the four six, but this one here has 291, 292,000 miles. These four sixes run forever, and they are they are really good motors. But and this one here was still running, still running good. But every once in a while, the oil pressure would have a light on, and then it go away. And that was because these pieces were floating around down in here. And they get sucked up to the old pump pickup tube and they cut it off for oil pressure. And then they'd, you know, then you move around, drive around, turn it off, and it'd fall back down. Then you did then it'd suck it back up and do it again. Anyway, so we didn't run it long at all. We didn't run it much at all. And I wanted to make sure I checked it before I went and go before I went to start thinking that maybe it was the uh, oil pressure sensor or something like that. Because they do supposedly go out. But I'm so glad I checked this and I'm just I just want to make this video uh, because between that and there's actually let me see there's quite a bit of just I don't know if you can see there's some, just some sludgy some metal the timing rails timing components are going to have to be changed out and that's no big deal and after this thing is done it's going to be really nice uh, and you know I checked to make sure there wasn't nowhere and ain't nowhere uh, much at all and uh so this here is it's gonna be really good when we fix it up and i'm just so glad i checked that and i just want to make this video just to, just to you know tell you you know you better play it safe than sorry and uh, we're gonna fix that and then we shouldn't have to worry about this motor at all i'm gonna put a brand new oil pump on it as well and uh should be good to go but anyway though i appreciate you watching uh please like and subscribe and uh, I will see you next time.